Hello, new friend. My name is Fred. The words you hear are in my head. I say I said my name is Fred, and I've been very naughty. The story I'm about to tell, I tell you, I tell you well, is of my dear Aunt Muriel, and just how I've been naughty. Viola the farm, my aunt lives there, with precious pup. And husband, dear, my heart beats as fast as I drew near. I feel so nice and naughty. I thought just how excited they must be that I would come today. They shout, come, Fred, who's our hooray? Dear boy, you look so naughty. That when my tired eyes beheld a doggy dog, like dog he smelled. D-O-G is what he spelled. And that is how I spell naughty. Alone was I with tender courage, and as all his fur, his furry forage, which I say did encourage me to be quite naughty. Courage, your hair. It reminds me of the first time I knew just how I felt about hair. It was a day I'd not forget, the day that I met, met my first pet. Oh, what a lovely gift to get. I'd never felt so naughty. My fuzzy friend is what he was, this darling little ball of fuzz. And oh, such fuzz, such fuzz it does demand that I be naughty. He looked at me with his fetching eyes, and fetching fur did hypnotize, and filled with joy, and filled with sighs, and that's when I got naughty. The stripping hair, the stripping curl, unfolded sweet memories of a girl whose tresses, oh, they twist and twirl, and tempt me to be naughty. Barbara, my love, was named, her fair hair, a mane untamed, until one evening, I'm ashamed, I got a little naughty. The look upon my lo young love's face was sweet as lace, but in this case, I realized she needed space. I never more was naughty. Well, maybe not never. Dear Cur, your fur and fleece remind of nothing found in humankind, but for one fellow who did find me to be, well, in a certain mood. Into my shop he walked one day with bush, bush above and beard bouquet. That's no toupee, I pray, no way. I, could, I couldn't help but be, you know. I'd never seen such hair before. His bangs they sang, his neck it beckoned. Eyebrows, armpits, all were reckoned. Soon I figured, what the heck? And, and guess how I was. Naughty. Sweet pooch, afraid I'll shave your tail. Why now, that would be weird. So ends our little story. But then my landlords did resume to free me from that porcelain tomb and ferry me to a private room. Your hero, ever naughty. Goodbye, dear sweet aunt, I'll miss your farm, and Eustace's amulet charm, and farewell courage, what's the harm, if I was slightly naughty? With love, Fred.